Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope that you guys had a great first week of the spring semester or a great second week if you started last week. Um, my school started today. Today is Monday. So I thought it would be fun to do a what's in my backpack um, pre-semester, I guess. Um, I did have one class this morning, but my backpack is still pretty clean. So um, I thought it would be cool to do like a before semester or like in the beginning of the semester and then like halfway through and see how like gross my bag gets. Because I just cleaned mine out last night and it was pretty gross and very different than what I have in my bag right now. So let's just go ahead and hop on in. Okay, so this is my backpack. This is the North Face um, Borealis backpack in navy and it has like rose gold touches all over it. Like these are rose gold and so is this. Um, I originally had the cream colored um, Jet Setter backpack and one, it was going to get way too dirty because this is always on the floor in class and um, it was just a little bit too small for me. I like a bigger backpack um, and I like this has a laptop sleeve in the back. Sleeve in the back. Um, but yeah, I really, really like this one. I just got it in the beginning of this, um, school year. So, so far it's doing pretty good. Um, it has a, like a thing right here. Um, it's like a cloth. I don't know what kind of material it is, but it's basically to put like your, um, your sunglasses. Um, I never put my sunglasses in here. They're always in my car, but, um, it's a nice little pocket, I guess. Um, on the front right here, I have a little hand sanitizer clip. This is um, from Bath and Body Works. Yeah, from Bath and Body Works. And um, this is just like the champagne toast hand sanitizer. But I was looking for this for so, so, so long. And me and Dylan finally found it the other day. So he was super excited to pick that up. It also has this, um, like, I don't know, badge reel. Um, this is just my school ID. It's super cute, I know. Um, I have to take this everywhere with me to get into, um, school sometimes you need it and they just like it when it's on you, so. I always keep it on my backpack and I really take it off. Um, I did switch badge reels so that I could have this one, but other than that, nothing's really changed, um, since last semester. In this zipper pocket, we have a lot of things. Um, first I have this, like, pen set or marker set. Um, this is what I use to write in my planner. I only use these. Um, I literally just got these in the mail. Um, these are Erin Kondrick multicolored dual tip markers. Um, I just started writing in my planner this year because it was January through, I think, next December. Or this December. But um, I just kept these in, like, this little container because they were super cute. And it's, like, a nice hard cover um, container so I just threw these in here in case I needed to write things down today so the next thing that I have in here is just this protein bar this is the kind protein bar it's double dark chocolate nut um, I really like these but I never really eat them um, for some reason I just keep one in my bag um, last semester I only had one class per day so that was really nice but um, this semester I have a very big gap like seven hours in between my classes and I live 45 minutes away from where my school is. So I figured sometimes if I want to stay and do like online homework, I would just keep this in my backpack. This semester I'm taking six classes. Three of them are online, so I'm going to have a lot of online homework. Um, I am taking pathophysiology, English, um, a math class online. that's like math formulas and probability. Um, I'm taking intro to nursing, um, chemistry with a lab, and then statistics. So it should be a very fun semester. <laughs> Next up, I have this, um, this is just like a note card case. I have blank note cards in here. Um, I usually just keep this in my bag just in case I um, like need to write on note cards or I want to flip through the ones that I already have done. I will probably use this more for patho or chemistry this semester just because my other classes I won't really need them. But I like to keep this with me at all times just so I have my note cards with me and I can study whenever. Next up, I have some clear eyes. Um, this is basically just visine. Um, I have contacts in right now and I wear my glasses sometimes. But mostly I wear contacts and they get um, dry sometimes. So I have this um, in my bag just in case. Next up is gum. This is just the Mentos Pure Fresh Gum. Um, I like this stuff because it's small and it doesn't take a lot of space. 
Um, but I usually just keep this always in my backpack. I usually eat it when I am bored in class, so yeah. The next thing that I have is just a um, hand cream. This is the champagne and apple, or champagne, apple, and honey. Um, this has been in my bag forever. I haven't even gone through like a whole tube. Um, but yeah, this is just from Bath and Body Works. I like having this just because my hands get really, really like dry, like right on the backs of my hands. Um, because Michigan weather sucks. So I just like having this around just in case my hands get really dry. Next, I have some ibuprofen. This is just Advil. Um, 200 milligrams. I keep this all with me in like my work bag and this bag because I get headaches really really bad like randomly throughout the day So I just like to keep it just in case I get a headache next up. I have a mini stapler This is just from like Target. I think um, I Realized very quickly that nobody has a stapler ever um, Sometimes teachers will have them but a lot of times they don't and in my math class He didn't have a stapler so I bought one just so I could have it with me and it's always nice to be the person that you can like hand your stapler around to other people so i always keep this with me just in case the last thing in like this part of the pocket there's like this zipper pocket and then there's like the back thing um i have my airpods these are just the airpod pros um i decided to put these in my backpack just because um like i said i have that big gap so sometimes i'm gonna want to stay and do some homework and I just wanted to have these so I could listen to music or listen to my online lectures. And I just have like a silicone sleeve that I got on Amazon over top of these just so that like the charging case didn't get all gross inside my backpack. Alright, so moving right along, we have like these little pockets right here. And right here I just have a glasses cleaner. Um, this is just a microfiber cleaning cloth. I haven't even had to open this yet. So, um, and I think I've had this for like two years. Um, but yeah, I just want to make sure that I'm not going to like rub my or my glasses on my shirts because I can like scratch them. So I just keep this with me just in case. You never know. Next in that little pocket, I have my Laneige Glowy Balm. This stuff literally doesn't leave my side, like I said in my last video. So I always have one with me. I actually am going to buy a new one soon because it's almost gone. So um, yeah, this is just my everyday, all day lip balm. And then right over here, I have um, these little tabs. These are just like post-it tabs. You can put them on your papers. I have the threes, and then I have um, all of these right here. Um, I actually, last semester, decided that I was only going to use one binder for all of my classes, which did not work out well. I don't recommend doing that. I only had four classes, but I had a math class, and it took up a lot of my um, storage, I guess, in my binder. So, um, what I would do was every time I needed to make a new tab, I just pulled these out, which was also very stressful and very disorganized, so don't really recommend doing that. But I did keep these in here just in case I ever do need to, like, tab my, one of my books or something. So, yeah, they're just in here just in case. And then in this zipper pocket right here, um, this is basically just, like, my pen and pencil, um, holder. I have two highlighters. I have a green and a blue highlighter. Um, I always keep two with me just in case I need to highlight like two different things or um, I just run out of one. Um, I also have two pencils. Um, I always keep two with me, like I said, just in case I run out of lead or something or the eraser isn't working on one of them. Um, I have a couple of different pens here. I have the Papermate pens. Um, I use these for work also, um, so I just have them literally all over the place. And then I have these pens. These are the Pilot G2 10s. Um, these are really, really nice, but they bleed. So um, I tend to use these only sometimes. But yeah, I just like having multiple different kinds of pens, I guess. All right, so moving on to the main, oh yikes, um, to the main one. I'm just gonna put this on the ground and then like take things out of it. Um, but first I'm gonna grab my I guess my planner so that's the only thing that's coming out of here so first in here like I said I have my planner this is my Erin Kondrick planner there's like a glare sorry um it just says my name on it um this is the academic planner and I was so excited that I finally bought this I went back and forth for a really long time deciding if I wanted to buy it and I finally took the plunge and I really really like it so first um I bought this one because it has like this little what is this projects and exams pages i think there's like 20 something of these in here and you can just write down all of your projects it says like what class is it what class it's for 
um, details about the project, important dates, and then you can like check off when it's like completed. So that was really nice. And then next, this is my monthly spread. Um, so I just color code everything. Every class is a different color and so does my work schedule. And then I have like this cute little um, thing right here. It's like a, I don't even know, like a bookmarker, I guess. Uh, it just clips in. But yeah, I have it like that. And then if you can skip forward a little bit, um, I have some of my stuff written down for the weeklies, but I still have to finish it. But yeah, I will eventually finish it when I get all of my syllabuses um, together and I can fill out my whole planner. So I'm sorry if everything just like shifted a little bit. Uh, my camera died. But next is my iPad. This is the iPad Pro. I have the keyboard and the pen. Um, I used this all semester last semester. Um, this was super helpful for anatomy. Um, I usually just download all my PowerPoints on here and then on Notability I can like write all over it like how this one is. Um, I actually wrote in all of this stuff and like throughout the PowerPoint you can see like I wrote all over things which was super super helpful and it was really nice because then I didn't have to worry about like not being able to see things um, because the way that they print them out at school there's like three PowerPoints and then like lines on the side so they were really really tiny. And um, yeah, I really liked that I could write all over this. I also do all of my online homework on here. My school uses Canvas, so I can access Canvas on here and I do all my online homework on this. I do have a MacBook and it's just way too heavy to bring to class every day. So I tend to reach for my iPad way, way more. So my last couple things is just like basic um, class stuff. I have a binder, like I said, it just came from stats. So um, I just have my syllabus in here and like some notes on the bottom. Um, I have some loose leaf paper and like some dividers. Um, I wanted to get like a binder to keep all of my paperwork in. I think I'm going to get a smaller binder just because um, I don't really need this one inch. I probably need like a half inch. So I will probably try and find one later on. But next, um, I have my statistics notebook. I wasn't going to use the notebook and just use that loose leaf paper, but I figured it's easier. Um, I can just put my notes in here or like keep them in like this little pocket right here until I get home and I can put this in my binder so I don't have to keep taking my binder every day to class because the days that I want to stay, I have to take my chemistry book and all that stuff. So I figured I would just save some space and get a notebook. Um, and then I just have a folder. Um, I usually just keep one with me just in case. Uh, it has four pockets, which is nice. And yeah, I just bought this from like Walmart. So, so my very last thing is my T. Um, I think this is the 34. Yeah, the T I 34 calculator. This is my graphing calculator. Um, I've had this since like high school. Um, I took calculus in high school, which I don't recommend. If you don't have to take calculus, don't take it. It's horrible, and I hated it. It's literally a different language, and I didn't understand it at all. Props to you if you understand it, because I did not. Um, but anyways, I was number, like, 32 in class, and they only had 30 calculators, which sucked. Um, and you could only take them home if there were enough for you to take them home, and literally nobody in my class understood calculus, so everyone took one home. So I just ended up buying my own, so I've had this since like junior year of high school. And um, it came in handy because at Western I did not have to take any math classes. And when I transferred to my school now, they were like, you're funny, you need math classes. So I am currently taking um, like intro classes. I took one math class last semester and then I'm taking another one now and then I'm taking statistics as well. So. This bad boy is finally getting used again. <laughs> so I hope you guys like this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe and like the video. Um, I will be posting, like I said, another one um, probably like halfway through the semester when my bag is like has so much stuff and that's unnecessary so you guys can see um, the difference between my bag now and what it's going to look like with all the wrappers and stuff um, halfway through the semester. Um, but yeah, I will see you guys next week. Thank you guys so much for watching again, and I hope you guys have a great next week of your third or second, um, week of the semester.